All right, so I came down to the Florida Keys to jump on a Belzona Boats 27cc with Nick and AJ behind me. We're gonna grab some lunch at Marker 88 and show you every detail on this boat along the way. All right, so I have Nick from Belzona with me. He knows this boat a lot better than I do. So we're gonna let him walk us through, starting up at the windlass and we'll start chipping away back towards the stern. So Nick, if you would be so kind, so right let's go ahead. We got a quick windlass. This is a, an option we have on our 27s. And, uh, also you have access, just in case if you ever get jammed up here, you have access to your chain down there. Moving back. We have our uh, optional bow seating option. Basically, there are two pieces. So you have port, uh, port and starboard. This stays with the boat. So this is your access. 200 feet of anchor rope and chain. Moving aft, you got uh, fully insulated fish boxes. All of our fish boxes are insulated and macerated. So on this boat, you got your, uh, your forward one and you got two on the back. Right here. 40 quart insulated uh, cooler, and then also drains out to the, to the deck. Moving back, we got a little side door into our cabin. We have uh, the option of a fully plumbed head. If not, you can just keep this a completely wide open space for storage. Here we also have an option for our, our enclosure, this nice polycarbonate. And uh, we do have an option as well for an acrylic, uh, basically a small windshield, would probably be about this high right here. You mentioned you can, with the hard top, a customize the paint color to the hole. Correct. So if you have a certain bootstrap, you want to match it to the underside of the hard top, we can paint that as well. Okay. So here, basically we have um, a Garmin 16 inch screen, JL Audio head unit, your vessel view, and then we have rocker switches. This is our standard panel. You do have the option to do a full face uh, panel if you want to do du uh, dual screens or single. And then you can do also Boca Tech switches. You do have uh, electric trim tabs, uh, your Garmin uh, VHF, and then your Mercury throttles. We do also have standard two cup holders on this side. All right, very good. And then right under here, the lead post, you do have a USB charger and then open storage for your keys, wallet, gloves. And then we do also have this, it's fully removable. Stow that down below, and then you can have a nice big open area for your, uh, for your lines. Nice. So here we have our jumper door. So basically, slide this back, pull this open. Comes right back. You also do have a standard uh, three-step ladder right here on the side. So you don't have to be going down into any other compartments to go grab it for your ladder. It's right there on the side of the hall. Then you have a foldable half bench seat, and then you got dual live wells. Standard will be the port side with 29 gallons, and then you could option out to have an 18 gallon uh, live well. Right now, this one's not plumbed, so it just has a drain on it, so you can use it as a small little cooler as well. About the leaning post. Here you got your tackle, tackle trays. Open storage. To store a nice large bucket in here. Or you can do double uh, tackle storage. You could also um, outfit with this with a slide out Yeti cooler. About a 45 quart. Very nice. Let's take a look at the bilge. Down here you have your holding tank. Pump out, live well two bilge uh, pumps, you got your raw water pump so, uh, and fresh water pump. Lastly, let's pop up one of the fish boxes for me, please. Ok, 
great size box if you guys can see it there hatches finished nicely even added their logo all right nick so i see this one is equipped with twin 200 v6s from mercury i hear that you're doing like 2.1 at 35 miles per hour great economy how much fuel is this holding so 200 gallons of fuel in total and then you have about 500 miles of range on a full tank and you could also option this out as a joystick as well with the, the optimus 360 and we're doing about 52 to 53 miles per hour of uh, full range and then you get a good fuel economy right around the 30 35 miles per hour these engines from mercury we just can't say enough about them it's great to see them on more and more boats and this boat in particular like you said 2.1 miles uh, miles per gallon doing 35 is excellent and how many gallons 200 gallons of fuel 200 gallons you know 500 miles of range is absolutely insane for a 27 footer a great combination with these mercuries So sometimes this job has benefits and today's one of them. We're actually gonna pull into marker 88 right there behind me on this beautiful Belzona 27 to grab some lunch, maybe get the drone up, um, just show you the whole lifestyle here in the Keys. It really doesn't get much better than this. Really nice boat, you can kind of do it all. It's made to make the family as comfortable as possible, but you can also deck it out to get some fishability out of it as well. So um, hope you guys enjoyed that. More coming soon on our YouTube channel. Make sure to subscribe and follow us on Center Consoles only, Instagram, YouTube, and anywhere else you find us. Thanks guys. guys for watching our vlog if you want to see our latest video please click right here and if you like what you see and you want to see more center consoles only content please subscribe right here thanks guys